Cookie here. We're doing a video on Clash Royale. And off camera, I made a tier four. I opened a crown chest and a free chest. And you guys won't believe what I got. It was just amazing. I got the Hog Rider and the Minion Horde. It is awesome, and I did upgrade my deck from whatever this deck was. I used to be using this deck now, but now I use this deck. I'll give it a go with this deck again, but instead I'm gonna plop in the witch, cause the witch is actually useful for once. So this is my deck, right for right now, and let's go ahead and battle in arena four. Since we haven't done this on camera yet, I decided this is awesome. Well, this is very special because we haven't done this yet, yet, but now we're doing it. So it's awesome how we actually get to do this. I'm going to place down this guy, then the barbarians along with the hog rider. The hog rider, one thing special about the hog rider is that it only comes with the, it only comes with the, a tower attack. So it can only attack towers, which is awesome and is probably one of the best things that about the Hog Rider that you could possibly have. It probably is the best thing, because it goes straight for the freaking tower. Like, who wouldn't want a Hog Rider that goes for a tower? I mean, that would be sick. This guy's just like, oh no, you're taking out all my troops. Well, too bad. Okay, so I might plop down a minion. No, I'm not going to plop down a minion horde. What I'm going to do is place down a hog rider and wait for all this. Place down a rage spell over there so the hog rider gets a big boost. I don't care about that tower that much. So what I'm going to do is place down some archers. And then I'm going to place down some arrows. Oh no, I have bad connection. How do I have bad connection? No! Okay, I have terrible connection. Which is bad, because I had bad connection. Yeah, a couple of seconds ago, I had terrible connection. Oh uh, no! Come on, defeat him! No, I lost. Uh, yeah, it's just because I had bad connection that time. That's it. Stank. Yeah. Don't get me further. Yeah, but I've already gotten. Pretty far. Oh no, I only have 18, then I go back to only a 3. I still don't have the expo. And I still don't have the freaking. I have every single card from this area in Arena 2, but I don't have every card. I, I don't have the lightning spell. I don't have the lightning spell. But I have every other card, except for the Goblin Bell Barrel. I don't have that one, too. And I, I, ha I have almost every single card from here except for the baby dragon, which stinks. Because I really want to get the baby dragon. Because <laughs> I haven't gotten that one yet. So, if I had enough, I could open that chest, but I don't have enough to open it. So, let's go back with this deck. Because this deck is a good deck. Now, let's go back and battle. Again with for Arena 4. So let's see. Arena 4 is a good arena to be in because it's a really good arena. And that means you're high. But later, you know, in the, high, in the game. Okay, so what I'm going to do is place down a Prince and then a Hog Rider, which is a really good combo. Because if you put down a Prince and a Hog Rider together, the Prince should help the Hog Rider and go for the tower, which ha the Prince has high damage. And then the Hog Rider also has high damage and high health. So that's a good combo to use. But then he plays down the minion horde, which doesn't do much. And the Hog Rider's still full health. Okay, I'm placing down the minion horde over here. His minion horde is going all out right now. What? My minion horde wasn't able to actually beat his. Okay, so... Uh, we're both tied. Why would you do that? You could have took off my minions. Or my other guy. My, uh, my... Oh, what? He has a minor? I don't even have that card. Come on. This is unfair. This is, this is totally unfair. He's gonna dig to my other... Oh, no. He didn't beat me. 
Ooh, that, oh no, why would you use that dude? I have a bunch of, oh my gosh. This guy is a noob, dude. Okay, I placed down my freaking hog rider over there. Then I'm placing down a prince, cause princes are awesome. I mean, give it up to the prince. What did, what, like he placed down an ice spell for no fair reason. What is he doing? What? what the heck is that guy doing? Wow, what the heck was that guy doing? That was hilarious. Go into another battle. Okay, pet the playhouse again. And let's beat this guy again. Because last time we actually beat the guy. Okay, so I'm gonna do the same exact combo as last time. Place down the prince first, and then the freaking hog rider in the back. Hog rider's the support. Well the prince is the main thing, you know. Okay, we weren't able unfortunately we weren't able to actually take the tower that time. Which means we can we're able to place down a witch which can cancel which which uh, which can cancel out the stuff which which can cancel out the other minions because that's it's a really good card. Use it more often. I know I know viewers who are watching this. You don't use that card that much. Use it. It's very useful. I'm gonna ignore this guy with this expo by placing down a army of skeletons, but the expo doesn't even go for the skeletons. Come on, expo. Okay. I know how this is. So I'm gonna save up for nine again and do the Cog Rider Prince combo once more. Bum, bum, bum. Eight. Nine. Prince. Boom. We have the Prince of the Hog Rider in the background going in for the assault. Oh, my Hog Rider is getting badly damaged, but that's no problem because my Prince is on top. My Prince is on top of the top of the world right now. The Prince can never be stopped. He's a beast, an absolute beast. There's just no way you can stop the Prince. And the witch. The witch has a completely skeleton army, which can never be penetrated because the skeleton army is too great. I'm placing down the minion who are right on top of your musketeer. That must be really annoying for you. Oh, he placed down an expo that just got destroyed. <laughs> the expo got freaking destroyed before it could even get placed down. Valkyrie. I am two steps ahead of you, boy. Two steps ahead of you. I know I'm not paying that much attention to my tower, which is bad. I should pay more attention to my tower, really, really. I should, I should really pay more attention to my tower. That's why I put down, hopefully he can stop him in time. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, eight, seven, six, no! Oh my gosh, if he didn't place that card down, I would have still survived. Okay. Okay, that, oh, great. Yeah, so, that was a pretty good battle. GG, man, GG. Yeah, so I think I might actually replace the witch with the musketeer. Or replace the witch with the balloon. I'm gonna replace the witch with the balloon because the balloon's a really good card. Now let's go ahead and jump into Arena 4 once more. And bam, Pekka's Playhouse. It, we're, we're home, Pekka, we're home. So now. Crap, this guy's just using a combo. Oh, I, I could have used the combo there. I didn't decide though, too long. Bum 
I'm gonna die. He definitely, he definitely gonna die. The musketeer's taking its range. Not very good range, but it's taking its range. The worst range of all. Yeah. Oh no, they took over my freaking tower. Come on, people. Hog Rider, go in and beat this guy. The Hog Rider's gonna leave that P.E.K.K.A. in the dust. He ran away from the P.E.K.K.A. and the P.E.K.K.A.'s gonna wreck him. That was a bad idea. A really bad idea. Oh, yes, I placed down the Valkyrie at the very, at the perfect time. The very, the best time ever. The best time ever. Yeah. So let's go ahead and place down the Spear Goblins again. Uh... Yeah, so we're doing pretty well. Not as well as I intended, but we're doing pretty, pretty well. Not that good, but pretty, pretty good. Come on, balloon, you're dragging the baby dragon back. Come on, use your giant bomb skills and drop that giant bomb. You failed me. You failed me for the last time. Oh my gosh, the baby dragon just keeps coming back for more. Keeps coming back for more hog rider. He wants that roasted hog there. He wants the roasted hog. He's probably just like, oh, I want that roasted hog. The roasted hog sounds so good right now. Yeah. Okay. Let's do another hog rider. Hog rider. Archers. Gotta love them archers. Place down the scale team. Place down the spear goblins a little bit back so they can get their range. Minion horde just to take out the troops from above, even though there's a freaking baby dragon there that nobody cares about. They're gonna be doing damage to the hog rider, which is dead. Comment, subscribe. I'm in this video here. See you guys next time.